Hey everybody, so today I'm going to be going to be making another video about the delusional delusional community. I'm calling I'm barely calling it a community, but I'm just going to call it that for the sake. I'm going to be calling out the uh, delusional delusional community known as the trans age community or age fluid community. If you remember like a little over a week ago, I made a video about this and how uh, how disgusted I thought it was. And I, I know it's disgusting. It is disgusting. And I was thinking to myself, okay, there's no way I'm about to make another video on this because it can't possibly get worse. Well, it does get worse. It does get worse. Because now we have someone on Twitter making Predator Pride flags. Now, before I get into this video, I just want to say that person who I called out in my last video, they blocked me. Pretty much, I put it on Twitter. I shared it on Twitter and it got blocked. I got blocked by them pretty much immediately. And now I'm not like heartbroken over, oh my God, they blocked me. I'm more than happy that they did that. But, um... Just want you to know what kind of person they are. They saw my video. They didn't respond to me in any fashion. They just decided to quietly block me and act like I, act as if I wasn't going to notice. So if you can all do me a favor and go to Twitter, find their profile. Don't harass them. Just mass report them. And just please get rid of this person. Now, I know Twitter's not going to be much cleaner with this person gone. Believe me, it's a terrible platform. But still, just do it anyway. So on with the video. A little over, like, maybe less than half an hour ago, I was looking on Twitter... And I was scrolling through the timeline, my timeline and everything, and Delusional Takes pops up again. Now, if you remember last time I gave them a, I didn't give them like a shout-out shout-out, but you know, I gave them some publicity. Hey, check them out. They're actually really good on Twitter. They put some really stuff, good stuff out there. Uh, and they posted this. Now, like I said, I did not think I'd be here again making another video about this situation. Yet here I am. As you can plainly see, they are making pride flags for being a predator. They even use the P word. I'm not again. I'm not going to say it because I feel like the YouTube system could hear me and they're going to do something stupid about it. But you can see that they clearly used the P word, and that means attraction to that thing. It's basically you're saying basically it's pride saying that you're a bad person. That's what it is. Now finding this person's Twitter account was not very difficult. I just did some searching and I found it. And also, you can't blame me, because I'm not the one who's going to be putting their username on the screen, but I went to their account, and they had, I'm not kidding, I counted 47 different flags that they made for representation of being a predator, delusional predator. That's what, they have made this many flags, look at them. Some of these are aesthetically pleasing in a way, but also, they immediately aren't, after you realize what they stand for. They literally made these flags, made terms up for them. And it's disgusting. I'm just going to read one of these here. Auto girl, auto girl slash auto P word girl. A term for when your gender is a girl connected to girlhood because of your auto P word. Term and flag by me. Don't, do you realize how insane that sounds? That sounds absolutely insane. The last video I made, I didn't think that anything could top that. But knowing Twitter, I should have known full well that they could have topped this. And here we are. And... The one flag on this that they made that really, really gets under my skin is this one, and I'll tell you why. Let me read the definition, quote, definition, quote, that they made for this. Auto cub flag. First of all, that's a terrible start. Cub is a terrible form of that I know of, I know of. and it's, it basically involves, f like, feral young animals. It's really gross. Maybe not feral necessarily, but regardless, it's really gross. Uh, that's a terrible start. And then here's the definition. A flag for a person who is both an auto P word and an auto zoo in a way that they see themselves as a young baby animal. You can use the emoji combo this for, or any animal to represent being an auto cub flag by me. I just can't believe that I'm reading this. I don't know who, who I don't know who hurt you. I don't know what made you, it was probably Sappho that did this to you, but um, it doesn't matter. You're just still doing this. You did this. I don't know what makes you think this is fine. Also, the term that they use, they're using the word to describe the crime and the type of person that is a horrible person. Do you, it's so just, just, it's so frustrating. Here's one that is called Bun Age. Horrible start. And also their name is Little Bun. Again, I'm not putting their at so you can't get mad at me i didn't they could change their name anyway bun age that's so that's just i just feel so gross reading this and they, the definition is a trans age term related to bunnies a term for where your age is a little bunny let me make something clear age is not a age is a number now i'm not trying to say the thing oh age is just a number that's not what i'm saying age is a number that's what it is i'm 19 right now at the time of recording this i'm 19 that's a number 
That's it's not a bunny. Clearly, not only are they delusional, but they're also really, 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 really stupid. If you haven't picked up on that, they're also really dumb. While we're on the subject of uh, animals, they also decided to two days after they made that um, whatever they called it auto cub flag which is just horrible to say, they b said, block and report, but be careful, there is a graphic image, crime, in his most recent posts. And they, under this person's profile, they have hashtag ZooPride. Now, hashtag ZooPride, that's terrible on its own. I think everybody knows about that. I don't. That's why I don't bother making a video about it. It's disgusting and horrible, and they're right to call them out for this. However, they have absolutely no room to talk when two days before, they said that you can identify as a young animal. We're having a serious case of irony overload here all right let's play a little roulette here i'm gonna just scroll to a random flag and read it all right here's one baby plus gender oh my god i can't believe i just said that a gender related to baby plushies that's not a gender stupid let's keep playing this game shall we here's one flag uh, older to younger younger to older flag for people flags for people who identify as age queer for any form and they I describe themselves as older to younger or younger to older now here's the problem with that you don't need a flag for every little thing that you do like you can describe yourself as something but you don't need a flag to represent it you don't have like let's say for example you are now trans age you went from female to male but also you crapped yourself at some time in your life like after the operation you don't need a flag for that. You don't need like the trans and in the middle there's a brown bar representing for the, the time that you crapped your pants. You see what I'm saying? You don't need a flag for every single little thing in the world. And besides, and I just want to say there is no pride here. They're saying, oh, they're pride flags? Well, there's no pride here. It's all embarrassment and shame and delusion and disgust. That's what all of this is. There's not a single shred of pride in here. Now, I've been searching for a little bit and I finally found the one flag that really sums up the entirety of this video. H queer map. Now, if you don't know what map means, it's a term that predators made up to make them seem more acceptable in LGBTQ community. I'm not making that up. It stands for minor attracted person. So basically, it's the same exact thing as a predator or a you know p word. It's the exact same thing. There's no difference. So let's read it. A flag for a person who describes themselves as a map due to being a younger to older so basically what they're saying they are attracted to minors but they're identifying as a kid or they're identifying as someone older whichever one you're quote identifying as it doesn't matter because you're clearly mature enough to know that you aren't actually that acceptable age of which you can do anything and besides there is no acceptable age of of offend of, of committing crimes you're just i this is so stupid if you're really drowning that deep in your own sea of delusion then like you need to get some serious help like go seek therapy please like seriously imagine raising a kid and just for just like working hard to raise a kid just for them to do this it's just so gross that's basically it for this video i just wanted to talk about this like i like i said i did not think i'd be back here i did not think i would be sitting here making another video about the quote trans age community i never thought i'd be back here again i thought i covered enough in the first one but apparently they just had to embarrass themselves even further so yeah thanks so much for watching i just want to give a little shout out to delusional to d i almost said posting and takes in the same word delusional takes on twitter go follow them that's where i got the idea to make this video and the previous trans age video video trans age video i got the idea from them and i want you to go give them some support and also i am not responsible for any harassment that has been directed at the person who I made the video about because I did not I put their their username appeared on my video not but their hand their, their name but not their username where they can be added so you can't get mad at me for that so that's going to be it for this video thanks so much for watching and take it easy everybody take it easy everybody I'm